this here story, I want to tell you about a certain fella. He called himself Andy. Andy Roberts. Now his entry into this world, well, no man would self-apply that journey. But then there was a lot about this Andy Roberts that didn't make a whole lot of sense. Maybe that's why I found this story so darned interesting. Now this here story I'm about to unfold took place in early 2009, just about the time of our conflict with the stock market, interest only mortgage rates, and just overall poor economic choices. I only mention this because sometimes there's a, well I won't say a hero because what's a hero? Sometimes there's a fella, and I'm talking about Andy Roberts here, the man child from Hilliard, quite possibly the most amazing in all of Hilliard County. Well, I bet he just, <laughs> seems like I'm getting ahead of myself. Well, here it goes. Story itself. Starts off at Hilliard Davidson High School. And there you be. I've done and introduced it enough. great today. I bet the boys really love that new top. Where'd you get it? Sears? Really? Because I feel so bloated. We just had a pizza day. Well, just quickly brought it out in the hall. Guys don't ask the stinky girl to prom. I know. Hey, Mitch. Check it out. Babes. I know. Babes. Dude, Billy, check it out. I know. I see. I see. God, we put that thing away for once? I'm just documenting life, man. God, I love senior year, right? Am I right? Rain and babes. Right, teachers? Right? Am I right? All right. Ladies? Our job is so stupid sometimes. Okay. Um, hey, guys, sorry about the course change mid-year, but uh, the English curriculum revision shows that reading the classics is no longer important, and... Because of the budget cuts that we've seen in the arts as of late, we now have... Artlish, which is a 12-minute class, so we need to kind of speed through this. Today, we'll be studying the graphic novel, The Dark Knight. Because it involves both art and reading. And the Lexile score shows that you should all succeed. Even if it's not challenging intellectually. As long as you like it, you'll learn. That is right. The only thing more absurd than Artless class would be shipping me to Bradley. <laughs> so, let's turn to page 64, and we are going to reenact the scene from the graphic novel, okay? Oh, and don't forget to draw what you see. And write how it makes you feel. Go. Uh, you want to know how we got these scars? My father was a drinker and a fiend. One night he goes off crazier than usual. Mommy gets the kitchen out to defend herself. He doesn't like that. <laughs> Not one bit. So me watching, he takes the knife to her, laughing while he does it, turns to me, says, Why so serious? Comes at me with a knife. Why so serious? He sticks the blade in my mouth. Let's put a smile on that face. And... See. Holy sweet goodness of the unknown. Oh, 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 oh. oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, that is so cool. Oh, it's filthy. Happy birthday! Teachers, sh shouldn't you do something? Okay, he sings bites, bleeding, burns, choking. He doesn't say what to do with this miracle 18 year old birth in class. What should we do? What should we do? This happened once while I was student yeah. teaching. Yeah. Uh, it was a small town. Okay. We put the man child in a cage. We tried his mother as a witch. And? She burned. Loudly. Whoa, Mama. What just happened? Oh my God. That, that just happened. Bam. Did the guy to go ratio get any worse in this room right now? Seriously. It's just a big rat. Mr. Van Gogh, yeah, yeah. can I please go to the bathroom? I have a lot going on right now, okay? I can see no, 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 whoa, no, whoa, no, whoa. no. It's uh, nine minutes into class. 15 15 rule. What? Rules are rules. Yeah, he's here. Who is that? 
Good question. I I'm sorry, who are you? Me? No, the other naked thing rolling around in its own filth like a county fair swine. Carolyn, I didn't even know you were... No? I wasn't. I, I couldn't be. I don't... The mess on the floor says differently. I have a promise ring, goon. <laughs> Looks like you broke that promise. Big time. Bite me. Real nice manners in front of your kid, Carolyn. All right, guys, settle down. Settle down, okay? It seems that we have a new student in class. I'm, I'm sorry, what was your name? Andy. Andy Roberts. Uh, children? Hi, Andy. Uh, Andy, would you like to come to the front of the class and tell everyone a little bit about yourself? Yeah. I've got it. Somebody help him. Mitch? Austin? Somebody? Isn't anyone going to help him up? Isn't that like discrimination? Billy? If you saw what I saw, you would know not to ask that. Uh, I'm Andy Roberts. Let's see, what else? Really? Nothing else that you can think to share with us? Why does he speak to me this way? He's a tad sarcastic at times. I don't like his tone. I don't like your tone. I sense a weakness in you. Oh, hey, hey uh, Andy, why don't you tell everyone, like, uh, maybe where you're from, for example? I'm sorry, what's your name? Mom. <laughs> Boys, enough! Seriously! I'm sorry, Andy. Alright. Oh, goodness. You have that back. It's a little... I appreciate it. Billy, pass. Carolyn? Carolyn. Where am I from? Uh... Mm, Hilliard? Yes. I'm Andy Roberts. From Hilliard. Do you know where Hilliard is? Hilliard is... Here. It's been 84 years. This is where I'm supposed to be. Oh, um, hey guys, that's the bell, so uh, please read something that you like tonight. And draw how it makes you feel. Awesome. Feeling. All right. We uh, wear them to carry our studies. Thank you. Okay, guys, have a good day. You will understand all of this very soon. But don't you, Nick? Yes. I will complete my work at home. Exercise by tomorrow. That is the Hilliard way. It's nice having you aboard, Andy. Thank you. Andy, right? Correct. Would you like me to be your student ambassador? Yes, very much. You missed the spot. Right. Hey, thanks, Andy, for leaving me with janitorial work during my planning period. Nice to meet you. Oh, 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 oh,